I'm Jordan Figuera. I'm a five foot eleven setter from Pacman Volleyball Club. I started doing camps when I was in grade seven, and I played f and I did a lot of camps within Pacman. And the coaches at the camps uh, mentioned me to the coach at my age group, and he emailed my dad, and I went to a practice like halfway through the season, and that's that's how I started. Uh, it would be probably Stephen Curry, to be honest. I know that's a pretty generic uh, answer, but uh, it would be Stephen Curry, and I would just I would love to talk to him because he's also an undersized player for his position, and as am I, and I would just love to talk to him about how he got to where he is now and how much how much training and how much effort it really took to get to that level and be the best player in the world at this sport. Uh, I feel like I have a big personality, so. My big personality really makes up for me being an undersized player and uh, it, it really helps me in the front row because I my block's not as big as some of these other guys. Like for example, Sharon, he touches 12 foot three, like can't match that. But I feel like I really hang in with those, those guys just because I have a big personality and um, I really present myself well on the court. So. I would have to say that my greatest sports achievement was making Team Ontario this past summer. Uh, it's, it was an honor to be uh, picked to that team and we actually won the NTCCs. So that was, that was really fun. It was really uh, nice getting to know some of the, the best athletes in Ontario a lot better and uh, building a bond with them. So that, I think that was probably my, my greatest achievement. When I need to be, I, I, I'm intense and I'm on the guys, but a lot of the times like uh, after games and such, I'm, I like to be funny and just, just relax and make jokes pretty much. So. I'm going to play univers uh, university, uh, so varsity volleyball. Um, I'm not sure where yet. I'm, I'm probably going to make a decision soon, but uh, I, yeah, I'm hoping to uh, play university volleyball. Uh, my biggest fear is would probably have to be spiders. <laughs> uh, the, there's a lot in my house, uh, at least in my washroom, and whenever I see one, I, I, I run out of the room and I ask my mom to come kill it. <laughs> My role models would have to be my parents. I know that's also a generic answer, but they they do everything for me, and I I aspire to be like them, and hopefully one day I can. They've built me to be the man I am today, and hopefully I can live up to what they are right now. My celebrity crush, I, I would have to say Selena Gomez. She's, she's pretty hot. <laughs> the advice I would give them is just to Never give up. There's going to be a lot of a lot of people who doubt you, and especially like me being undersized. And I don't know if they'd be undersized, but uh, just to never give up and always have a dream and believe in that dream, and just do what you can to achieve that. I think it's just because this this year uh, after playing on Team Ontario, uh, I just I've become a better person, a better leader on the team, on and off the court. So I think he's seen that, and that. I, I think that's why I've achieved that. Um, I, I didn't necessarily play as much as I would hoped, but it, it, it was a great learning experience for me because I learned to uh, put others before myself because before that I wasn't really used to not playing as much and it really got me to um, really just do everything for the team and know that the teammates beside you are they're fighting just as hard as you are for that starting spot. So. I think that's that's why. That's why. Well, I, I think we have a pretty good chance, but Aurora is playing amazing lately, and uh, if we can just come out with the same energy that we do most of our games, then we have. I think we have a pretty good chance of, at winning with the team we got this year, which is amazing. Uh, the one hand, uh, gee, uh, I got a pass, it was a, it was, I don't even think it was that tight, it was, it was a little tight, but I decided to be a little flashy and uh, I, got, I got lucky, honestly, I, I don't do that often, but I got, I got lucky.